What's up, y'all? It's your girl and I for kicks. We are at the mall, which is not unusual for your girl, but we are doing a mall vlog pickup today, which is a little bit more unusual. Y'all probably already know what pair your girl is about to pick up, but I'm gonna show you anyhow. We're gonna do the whole proper vlog for you. All right, y'all, let me go ahead and show y'all what we got on feet today. Something, something slight, but I felt like flexing a little bit. Y'all see it, it's the Jordan 4 Dornbeckers. Like I said, some slight, it matched the anti-social shirt. The back has little frogs on it. So I was like, let's go ahead and rock with it. So let's go grab these shoes. But first guys, we need coffee. All right, y'all, we've secured the coffee. Now it's time to secure. All right, y'all, what do we think about the Burgundy Fives? I know we have the Amma Manier Fives coming out that are super, super similar. I'm also trying to mask out the music a little bit. But guys, let me know. I, I got my hands full, so I can't pick them up, but what do we think of them? Was it a cop or a pass? What are we waiting on if we didn't pass, or if we passed on them? Y'all know your girl is a sucker for the little tiny baby shoes. Look at them, oh. Of course your girl didn't get the nice box. I got the very basic Jordan 1, you know, grade school problems, but it's a clean shoe. Let your girl know what we think about it. I'm not mad at it and I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet. All right, y'all, so we got someone here in finish line that's got them on foot. I just think, I don't know, man, in hand they're all right, but on foot they're kind of fires. All right, y'all, so we are back in the sneaker room or sneaker closet. Um, your girl did secure the bag, as y'all saw. Like, how fire do these things look on feet, though? I just, I don't know, man. I this, I'm telling you, this happens every single time. And I'm not, I know I'm not the only one that deals with this, where you have a pair, you're trying to pick it up, maybe you wanna flip it, make a little bit of money to help support your sneaker habit, and you get it in hand and you're like, hmm, like what do I want to do? I don't know what I want to do with this pair, but let's go ahead and get a nice little, you know, a proper look at them. And then a nice little comparison for y'all because that's what we're doing lately. A lot of these colorways that are coming out are so similar to something that they already released for us. So, you know, it's kind of like, do you need both? Or which one would you pick? And so we're going to get into that in a second, but... And then, like, like that smell, I, I don't know, guys, it's just, I mean, we all know. We all know that smell, that, that brand new, straight from the factory, never had a foot in it, Nike smell, Jordan smell, like sneaker smell. That's what we love. But it is the Palomino ones, as your girl said. It is a very clean shoe. Um, I, I've always thought that it was a little bit too dark. Um, it's, it's a lot of dark brown. It's a lot of black, but it's a clean shoe. I do like that they did that little pop of gold on the tongue right there for us, which your you know, your label. It's a very, very clean shoe. You've got the brown bottom, obviously, to match it. The, I mean, like I said before, they did us dirty with the grade school. You didn't get that fancy, nice box with, like, the metallic gold writing on it that the men's pairs got but we also didn't have to pay the same price tag so i'm trying to find a silver lining on that one um but anyhow you know the suede the suede isn't the best i've already seen a lot of images a lot of videos on facebook or uh instagram surface that say make sure you check your pairs I'm not mad at how this pair looks. I have seen a pair that was pretty, like the suede or nubuck was pretty 
scratched up like it looked rough and worn already and obviously these things just dropped I'm not mad about it I don't hate them um let's get into the real question here though guys are they better than the mochas now if you've been into sneakers actually pause before I get into this whole debate I realize I didn't tell y'all to go ahead and subscribe to the channel so if you haven't done so already Go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Give your girl a thumbs up for making this mall trip, making this much needed long overdue blog, or vlog for y'all. And then, okay, we'll go ahead and get back into the comparison. Guys, let me know in the comments below, first of all, which one, like, which one are we going for? It's, it's battle of, you know, essentially that mocha colorway. Are we going with the mocha Jordan ones? Are we going with the Palomino ones? I've seen a lot of people saying they might prefer these, but your girl is going to go with the mocha ones. I really love a good black toe. It's the color blocking. It's not too dark because you've got a ton of white breaking up the darker colors. This is going to be the winner between the two for your girl. But I don't know. This this may still be a pair that stays in the collection. I'm, I'm really, really torn on it. It happens every time. Um, shout out to First Class Laces for the rhinestone laces on this pair. Y'all go hit him up on Instagram, First Class Laces. I'll drop a link in the description below. When I tell you, if you're looking for a pair of laces, odds are he's going to have them for you. So go check him out. Um, you know, let him know an eye for kick sent you his way. But these are going to be the winner for me. But it's still a clean play clean pair so let your girl know in the comments below what we're doing and if we are adding a pair of the palominos fresh to the collection guys you already know we got to go ahead and protect it with rejuvenators rain and stain protector uh, i'm not going to go ahead and spray these right now on camera because i'm still torn on if i'm even going to keep them but guys if you're grabbing a pair of these make sure you protect them we've got fall and winter right around the corner you don't want to mess up a fresh pair of kicks such as this also code um and i believe it's an i i feel like i've been saying it all the time i should know this but code and i saves you some money link is in the description below um as well as everything else all the important and valuable links but guys that's it. That's today's pickup vlog. That's today's, you know, unboxing. What are we doing with it? Um, let's see. Event-wise, SneakerCon Tampa has been rescheduled, as I said the last video. So that's going to be September 23rd. So you still got some time. If you change your mind, head on down to Tampa. Uh, or you could head over to Detroit. I believe it is not this weekend, but next weekend, Kicks Through Your Soul will be in Detroit. So we have no shortage of events going on for my fellow sneakerhead. So go find one in your area. Hopefully it's one that your girl has referred you to. Um, but yeah, guys, like I always say, keep tuning in. See what I've got my eye on next.